there we go. Hey, it's John here. Welcome back to another Minecraft tutorial. Today, we're going to be talking about servers, specifically, uh, well, Hypixel. I've been asked a question a couple times in the last couple days, which is odd enough. Hey, do you know the, uh, the IP address to Hypixel? Yeah, yes, yes, I do. I do know the server IP to I Hypixel only because I played it fairly regularly, so I know that IP. Another one that I was looking up was I had to delete and remove one of my favorite servers that I play on all the time, and that is the Love Cub server. I was having some kind of glitch, so I had to delete it. I'm like, wait, what was that IP address again? So I went onto his website and I found it and I pulled it back up. It's play.lovecubsgaming.com. Well, Sometimes it's hard to find some of these because you don't know what website to go to if you don't know the IP address to go to. So it's Love Cubs Gaming for Love Cubs. It's Hypixel.com for Hypixel. Um, uh, Mindplex.net, I believe it is, for Mindplex. It's so many different websites to go to to find the IP address to play these games or to play on these servers. So how do you find all these wonderful servers? Well, I found a website that can assist in this. At least I think it can. <laughs> uh, let's see here. See on Hypixel, you'd go to Hypixel. Oh, it's Hypixel.net even. It's not even Hypixel.com. Hypixel.net. And then there's a server address. You click on it one time, it copies it, and then you can go to and set up a server. I'll show you guys how to do that in just a second too, just in case you don't know. Most of you guys know how to do that. It's just a matter of finding said Hypixel server. Well, um, I found this website. It's Pretty great, to be honest. I've never used it before, but I was searching around trying to find a good example for you to share with you guys. And I found this, it's uh, minecraft-mp.com slash search slash. <laughs> um, it takes you to this wonderful website. Um, I did type this in last time and it gave me this weird error uh, that I couldn't find this error 404. If you click on search at the very top over here, if it gives you an error, it takes you to this page. This page here is what, you're, what we're looking for. Now you can search by kind of server you want to play. Like say you want to play a prison server. You can just select prison server and you can select search and it'll pull them up by rank right, right down here, which is pretty cool. Um, it gives you every server that's available that is public. If I go up here and I unclick this and I click and I search for say T-Blitz, And I say search, nothing will show up because my server is private. It's meant for Patreons only. So it's not going to allow anybody to access it. It's a whitelist only server. So like say I do want to search for Hypixel. I type in Hypixel. I don't select a, brand, a type of server because Hypixel is like a all in one, right? It's a little bit of everything. I can click on search and it gives me everything that's linked to Hypixel. Um, but here's the, the main one that pops up, mc.hypixel.net. That is your server IP address. Um, some of these are obviously not Hypixel, uh, but the very top one, that's the, the IP address. You would copy that and you would put it into your Minecraft. Let's go back to Minecraft. Uh, let's go to, let's blow this up. Okay, let's go ahead and let's add a server. Uh, right now I only have uh, Lubbycraft loaded in here. Let's go ahead and add a server. I'm going to go ahead. I copy that, that last one where it was mc.hypixel.net. And I can call it whatever I want. Otherwise, it'll just be listed as Minecraft server. I can just type in Hypixel because I like it to look nice <laughs> on the screen. I can say done and it'll load up and it'll say Hypixel there. Then it'll load up their screen, which is down here. And it'll tell me how many people are online of how many people. Um, Lubbycraft, for whatever reason, no matter how many people are online, it only ever gives me either a zero or a one. It's really odd. I don't know why it does that. But I mean, there could be 20 people online. And it'll still give me a zero or a one. And that's it. But uh, yeah, so if I wanted to say I do want to go and find uh, the Lubbycraft server, um, something as small as his, which I was, I'm was i hoping will become a lot bigger of a server in the very near future. Um, a lot of people do play on there, but it's not as many as I would like and not as many as he would like, I'm sure. But we're going to go ahead and share that really quick. We're going to type in Lubcubs because that is his channel name. And I'm going to go ahead and select search down here. And sure enough, there is his server play.lubcubsgaming.com this is a pretty good search to be honest so let's type in like uh mineplex if i want to try to find mineplex and i don't know what website to go to i can just type in mineplex in here and say search and sure enough there is mineplex this is the easiest way to find any server i have found online 
uh, just by going to this website. Again, it's minecraft-mp.com slash search or just by clicking the search. If I, if I go to the main page, if I don't do the slash search, I can just click search at the very top. But yeah, there we go, guys. <laughs> That's basically it. That's how to go ahead and jump on uh, to a server that you want to play. It's the easiest way to find a server. But yeah, dudes, I hope you guys enjoyed. This was a very quick uh, how-to video. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did or you want to learn a little bit more about um, Hypixel servers or other servers that are uh, available out there for us to play, uh, let me know in the comment section below. Or if you guys want to see me play some mini games on here uh, with some friends, let me know as well in the comment section. Uh, I'm happy to do so. Uh, I, I do love this server. It's got a lot of really cool, really cool games on here that are fun to play. Uh, if you guys are at all new to this channel, if you guys could click that subscribe button, it's greatly appreciated. And while you're at it, click that little bell, that silly little bell. It turns on notifications to let you guys know when we upload our videos. And until next time, guys, see ya.